gonna drive back here. I'm not supposed to. Oh no. If that's got a new front end, that's our truck. Oh no, no freaking way. No freaking way. Well, guys, welcome back to the channel. Starting bright and early, we got another one. We got two McGoy's kits going on today. Nine inch, 26 by 12 Forgiatos. Every day is Forgiato day. We had a the nine inch that we filmed on Forgiatos yesterday. We got the one coming in today. And there's another uh, nine inch McGoy's kit with control arms that we're doing today too. But we're starting off the early, uh, Starting off early today, Forgiato, Forgiato Friday has become Forgiato every day. I finished my video for yesterday. I got it, or I know I finished the video, the any level lift update that you guys will have already seen on the channel. I gotta edit the Forgiato video from yesterday. These are the times I like. It's 8.15, there's nobody in the showroom. We've already got a McGoy's kit in the shop that they're getting started on. We got a, potentially another McGoy's kit that's on the schedule today that I'm sure he will be here because they almost always are. I mean, it's very rarely that we have cancellations. But these are the times that me and Jake, I'm just gonna throw it out there. It's 8.15, there's nobody in the showroom, the phone's not ringing. I said it to a customer earlier. It's a great morning. It's a good word to describe. 90% of our mornings at eight o'clock are in the ambush. Yes. And yes. that's not a problem. We love that we love the company. It's just a lot at one time. And everybody is chipper. They come with this super high energy and we're just like, it's a little overwhelming at times, but this morning, the uh, universe has chosen differently. The vibes are great. I've already had my Chick-fil-A for the day. There wasn't too much traffic on the way to work. We're putting on another set of Forgiatos today. I mean, as of right now, I don't see what could mess the day up, but there's a good chance that this clip could stop right here, and it's, well, something happened. That's normally how it goes, but hey, it's a great day. Vibes are good. Forgiatos are going on. I'm not upset. Look how big he is. I know. Hi, buddy. It's 35 pounds now. How old is he? Only two months. Two months? Yeah. You're a big boy, huh? You're a big boy. You still making messes all over the place? Yeah, buddy. Came from the bed. What'd you have done? He was his back. What's he doing? It's like losing hair back there. Hi, buddy. Are you okay? Are you messing with your back? Why are you messing with your back, huh? You smell my doggies? A good boy. Look how big those feet are. He's gonna be a big boy, huh? He's gonna be a big boy. Okay, all right. <laughs> Man, this thing, Does these tires look ride, ride nice. Does it ride better? Hell yeah, I like this. A couple days ago, we put some 38s on this, upgraded from the 37s. 38, it just, when you pulled up, I'm like, damn, who is that outside? And I saw it and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> if y'all haven't seen this video, I mean, he's been in videos for the last week or so. Um, make sure y'all go check out the uh, most recent videos to see more of this truck. Got the KG1s. 26, 14, Phoenix, 38, 13, 50, 26s. One of the, I had to do the big windshield. I love when people do the big windshield stickers. You know, I've, I've sold a couple of sets of traction bars because of your truck. Really? People love the traction bars, yeah. yeah man, the, there was a guy up here last time you were up here that, that ordered a set, same day. Yeah. I went ahead and ordered them because he wanted them. So we put a set of four Jettos on his truck a couple weeks ago and he wanted to do the traction bars, so. I, I need to have to get, get better, man. Who? <laughs> What's his name? Uh, the one that hurt his uh, shoulder. Oh, Jordan? Yeah, man, them tires rubbing the hell out of me. Is it? Yeah. We can get it cleaned up. We'll What's get it. This side right here. We'll get it cleaned up. On the front? Yeah, right here. You can see. Oh, we'll get it cleaned up. No, it looks factory. I know it does. <laughs> I'm telling you, he's. He knows what to do when it comes to uh, trimming that. Nah, it looks good. It looks good. I, I've always thought it was so cool that your truck has a, is it just a Carhartt interior package? Yeah. So he's got the, obviously got the bows in here, but he's got the, the Carhartt seats, which is super cool. Top and bottom leather. Oh, shit. Go 
That's cool. Sunroof. You actually like little kids. Up control on. It's a beautiful truck. 38s look really good. We gotta start selling more 38. Two trucks on four Giados, two days in a row. I'm a little upset that I didn't bring my truck up here because, you know, I wanna be outside with the four Giados. We, we outside. Ah, how am I supposed to be outside with the four Giado gang if I don't have my four Giados? Jimmy, did you drive your truck up here? Jimmy, did you bring your truck? No, yeah, Jimmy ain't got his truck either. So I guess I guess I get a pass for this one. I get a pass. Um, this is a build that we've had on the schedule for it seems like almost a year. You know, sometimes like hell, Ramon's truck took us six months to build. Um, this one took six eight months to build. Not for any particular reason. You know, some people have to wait for wheels. You know, it's just different different things that happen in life. Um, so we did. Uh, Leonard specifically told me, and you guys don't call me and say, hey, can I do this? Don't call nothing. No, do not call me and try and bug me about this. Leonard specifically told me they sent an extra shim for the for the struts in the front. So this truck is technically sitting at nine and a half inches. McGoy's only makes seven to nine. They don't make a 10 inch kit anymore. As far as I know, Jimmy got one of the only true 10 inch kits or one of the last ones that we did. FTS sells a seven to 10 inch kit, 100%. McGoy's only does a seven to nine. I believe they stopped the seven to 10 because they were having uh, drive shaft issues in the back, which is why anytime you do a nine inch lift kit, we gotta add the CV axle spacer. But we got this one with a nine inch McGoy's lift. I'm just gonna say nine to make it easy. Nine inch McGoy's lift, 26 by 12, four Giados. Same ones that went on my truck, the Flusos. Absolutely beautiful. Love the four Giados. 37 inch Gladiators. The X Comps. One of the most aggressive tires. Uh, the RSTs are super beautiful. Uh, I'm well, actually, I can't even say this. It's Trail Boss. Sorry, not RST. Trail Boss. I was going to say, I haven't really seen this grill too much, but it's Trail Boss. All I'm saying, two sets of four Giados, two days in a row. I can't complain. You know what I mean? Leonard hits me with, the, oh, my truck's not clean. You're not allowed to film it. Get out of here. Get out of here with that trash. I'm out here trying to give you compliment. Look how nice that orange looks. So when you're standing all the way at the front of the shop, down there when they are, or where they are, this truck looks so good because all you see is that real nice orange underneath there. 355 Dittos, 24 by 12 Ford Giados with the burnt orange BDS. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. It's a great opportunity to do a little side-by-side -side comparison. Uh, we still have the Tahoe, yes. I saw somebody comment the other day, yes, we still have the Tahoe at home. Um, we just haven't really been messing with it, to be honest. Uh, I would love to lift it at some point, but I just ain't really been messing with it. So, I mean, yes, we still do have it at home. It just sits in the garage the whole time. I'll have to film it when I get home so you guys don't think I'm lying. Um, I believe 2.4 drop on the Tahoe, and then obviously 9-inch lift on 2616s, but we got the 26-inch Coco Tours silver on the 2.4 drop lower Tahoe. Super nice guy. And then we got an old dude inside, Jake, the 9-inch McGoys, 26 by 16s. I love the lower Tahoe, I really do. But the lift kit just has such a different presence to it, such a better look. I don't know. I, I love the lowered. I, I think I'd want one of each, to be honest with you. Because we got the lowered level, super clean with the 26s. But that, that big, I just love the big presence of a lifted truck. I don't know. I couldn't do it. Rolling down the road and just no poke, all poke. Y'all know which one I'm, I'm rolling with. I just, I got to be lifted. I have to. The lower one looks good, but let me know in the comments what you guys think. Lifted, lowered. one of the more suspect things I've ever done. Yeah, I'm still gonna do it. Yeah, and a mouthful of sunflower seed, here's the deal. There's a cop sitting right there too, kind of kind of weird. There's a build that we're doing in hopefully about a week, 2616 Ford Giados, big lift kit. Sorry, I'm looking around while I'm talking. The whole nine yards, chrome lift kit. And apparently this truck is being delivered to a dealership somewhere, like near me. And um, within the next day or two, that lift kit's supposed to be, or that, that truck's supposed to be here. So I'm kind of snooping around 
to see if I can find the truck if it's here, which I don't think it's here. But uh, doesn't mean I don't want to snoop around and look a little bit. I don't feel like it would be parked out front. I got some flower seeds in my mouth, sorry. It's awkward. I'm gonna drive back here, I'm not supposed to. black truck. Oh, no. Look. If that's got a new front end, that's our truck. Oh, no, no freaking way. No freaking way. No freaking way. Holy crap. I gotta call Jake. I gotta call Jake right now. Holy, there's no way I just did this. Holy crap. No freaking way. He better pick up the phone. No way. Hello? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. You're on camera. What's up? Is that black truck a high country? Which one? No, it's RST. Bro, I'm looking at a, a new body style front end Silverado high country at this dealership over here. No way. Getting loaded off the truck. Silverado, I'm looking at it right now. So that means his is right behind it then. It's gotta be, but this is a black one. I thought it was his. No, his is a black RST. So that means it, it technically it could be here somewhere. Could be, but he got GPS tracking on it. His app updated a couple of days ago, and it's there. It's somewhere around there. Oh, this I'm dude. I'm looking at a new body style Silverado getting pulled off the trailer right now. It's on the trailer still. It's on top of the cab of the 18 wheeler. Is it beautiful? It's oh, it's it's gonna kill the game. We're gonna kill the game. You want me to send you a picture of it? Yes, I'm gonna send you a picture of it in a second. All right. Alright, bye. This is crazy. Look, y'all see it? Look, look at that new front end. Some guy hadn't even been unloaded off the truck yet. Look. That's crazy. This guy, look, the guy's unloading the truck. I know he's gonna get mad at me for this. going on literally getting loaded off the truck right now this is the craziest thing I've ever done I just had to pull back here too y'all are gonna think this is set up I had no idea this truck was here that's crazy can't believe I'm gonna watch this truck get unloaded now, I don't know if this is my customer's because he's, uh, from what I'm told, he is an RST, is what Jake just said. This one's a high country. We may be wrong. This might be it, but regardless, this is crazy. Getting getting to watch, I feel like street speed, getting to unload a truck off the, the damn trailer right now. Look at that. <laughs> what, what is my life, man? What is my life? Getting to watch this come off the trailer. That's so crazy. 
front end and I pulled around. I mean, it looks just like the like the new GMCs because we, um, as far as I know, we were the first to build one of the uh, the first GMCs. We did a six inch on the new body style GMC like two or three weeks ago. But I know this is my truck, so I'm not gonna touch it. But yeah, so the inside's the same as the GMC. So if you guys have seen the uh, the video of us do the GMC, but I'm, I'm still a Chevy guy till the end, obviously, with the different badging on the side. And as far as I know, the suspension is the same. Yeah, it looks all the same. This one's got the adaptive ride control. But obviously the, the front is definitely different. That's so crazy. You try, whatever you have made my day. You have no idea. Thank you so much. Sure. That's crazy. And there it goes. Into the lot. Ready for new owners. Hopefully, hopefully my, my guy. Hope so. That's crazy. That's absolutely crazy. What is a uh, well, what is my life right now? That if There's no better way to end off a video than that. I don't really know how to top this. So this build truck just like that, whether that's my truck or not, coming down the line within the next two or three days, within the next week. Hope you guys are excited. 12 inch, all chrome FTS lift, 26 by 16, Forgiatos, Nitto tires, coming soon. Let's get this bread. Get it, bro.